In the last modules, we have discussed the classification of amino acids. In this module, we will discuss the classification of proteins. The classification of proteins depends on their, on, or it is based on the, their function or their shape and size, biological functions or actions, and solubility and physical properties. And finally, it is also based on the quality of proteins, either they are first class proteins or second class proteins. Functional classification of proteins includes the catalytic proteins. These specialized proteins are called enzymes, which catalyze the biomedical reactions, which means that enzymes, you have, as we know, these are proteins. Iske saath metallic group, prosthetic groups lage hote hain, ya uske bhiar bhi hoti hai, ek function kar sakte hain, but more, most are with the help of these prosthetic groups, and these are the sequence of amino acids, or therefore they are enzymes. They are called proteins. ये इनका एक्शन क्या है कि ये एंजाइम्स जो हैं ये बाइंड करते हैं विद दी सब्सट्रेट और एंजाइम सब्सट्रेट रिएक्शन से दीज प्रोटीन्स कन्वर्ट दी सब्सट्रेट इनटू दी प्रोडक्ट्स सेकंड टाइप ऑफ फंक्शनल क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ प्रोटीन्स इज दी प्रोटेक्टिव प्रोटीन्स व्हिच इंक्लूड्स अ इम्यूनोग्लोबुलिन्स एज वी हैव डिस्कस द इम्यूनोग्लोबुलिन्स ब्रीफली इन द मॉड्यूल ऑफ कार्बोहाइड्रेट्स these freely circulating proteins protect the body from invading microbes such as bacteria or viruses by inactivating or killing them through various mechanisms. So, immunoglobulins ka functions kya hai? Ye bhi proteins hoti hain, lekin humne usme dekha tha ki isme variable component bhi hota hai aur constant component bhi hota hai. To ye differently behave karte hain, different invading bacteria or virus or foreign body ke saath. और ये उसके साथ मिलके तो इसको इन्वेजन को रिस्ट्रिक्ट करती हैं। नेक्स्ट क्लास ऑफ सब क्लास ऑफ दिस फंक्शनल क्लासिफिकेशन इस फेब्रिनोजन। फेब्रिनोजन इस आल्सो अ प्रोटीन। दिस फॉर्म फॉर्म्स फेब्रिन क्लॉट एंड स्टॉप्स ब्लीडिंग फ्रॉम दी वूंड्स। जब भी हमारी स्किन पे या इंटरनली कहीं भी को वूंड bleeding or ultimately is ke upar ek plug sa ban jata hai jo plug jo hai usko hum clot bolte hain aur ye clot jo hai it is composed of fibrinogen and many others many others tissue factors so the fibrinogen jo isme hai wo protein hai and it is a form of proteins and classified in the functional classification of proteins third is the regulatory proteins which includes hormones Hormones control genetic expression, cellular signaling, and biomedical or biochemical reactions catalyzed by enzymes. Enzymes are either activated or inactivated through the modification of their structure. So hormones are also proteins. Hormones kya hai? Ke ye produce hote hain in multicellular organism mein glandular tissue se gland wala tissue jo glands hote hain. उससे ये प्रोड्यूस होते हैं और इनकी साइट ऑफ एक्शन इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम देयर साइट ऑफ प्रोडक्शन अगर एक जो हार्मोन है वो प्रोड्यूस हो रहा है एक पर्टिकुलर ग्लैंड से तो वो उसका एक्शन उस ग्लैंड के ऊपर नहीं है वो उससे डिस्टेंस किसी और जगह पे उसका मोड ऑफ एक्शन है वहां पे एक्ट करेगा और सर्कुलेशन के थ्रू ये सर्कुलेट करके उस पर्टिकुलर एक्ट जो है ना जहां इसने एक्ट करना है वहां ये पहुंच जाएगा और अल्टीमेटली ये मॉड्यूलेट करेगा through the modulation of enzyme or its activity modulate ho jayegi or its physiological functions jayegi body ke wo change honge due to the secretion of enzyme and their action. So these are regulatory proteins and these hormones are also enzymes. Examples of proteins hormones are growth hormone jo maari growth ko affect karta hai. Similarly is the insulin and glucagon as we all know that it is used in the, these hormones are used in the regulation of metabolism of glucose. Similarly is the somatostatin which is also a hormone and which is also a protein based hormone and this is the other name of somatostatin is the growth hormone inhibitory hormone. Fourth one is the 
functional according to functional classification of protein is the structural proteins these proteins forms various body structures like collagen elastin and keratin we have already briefly discussed the collagen kya hai ye connective tissue ke andar jo hai na protein hai ye connective tissue ko jodti hai aapas mein ground substance mein bhi available hai or this is almost the most abundant protein in the human body elastin is also a type of protein which is also present in the elastin in the connective tissue jo elasticity hamari body ke different tissues mein hai this is due to elastin jaise hum is skin ko agar khinchte hain to ye wapas aa jati hai to ye wapsi jo hai iski apne its own shape ko maintain karna hai it is due to the elastin and which is again the protein next one is the keratin as we have discussed in the initial modules of proteins that keratin is a keratin is a protein which forms the nails scales of the of the fishes horns hairs feathers and even the horn of we have discussed in the first module that the horn of the rhinoceros is also produced or formed from the keratin transport proteins is the fifth of the functional classification of proteins these proteins transport various substances from one part of the body to the other for example hemoglobin which transport oxygen from lungs to the tissues and carbon dioxide from the tissues to the lungs the other type of protein in this transport protein is transferrin protein which is used for transport of iron sixth class of this function according to fun classification according to function is the contractile proteins these proteins are involved in the contraction of muscles and relaxation jab bhi koi muscle contract hota hai relax hota hai to usme proteins involved hoti hain and these are myosin for thick filaments and actin for thin filaments of skeletal muscles ye jo skeletal muscles hamare hain iske andar ye jo movement hai this is due to the protein part of the muscle which is actin and myosin and similarly cardiac muscles mein bhi ye proteins hain actin and myosin aur uske upar aur proteins bhi lagi hui hain jo troponin t aur i hai these are also proteins which are cardiac markers jab bhi cardiac attack hota hai ya heart attack hota hai to usme hum level check karte hain wo troponin trop t ya trop i usko bolte hain wo troponin t aur i are also protein and which are increased in case of damage to the heart muscles so this is the next part of class of the proteins which are called the contractile proteins